What's going on riders? It's Paul with another Ride Home Review. This week I watched War for the Planet of the Apes uh, starring Andy Serkis, Woody Harrelson, and Steve Zahn and directed by Matt Reeves. Uh, this is the last, well, um, I would say this is the third in the, I think it's the end of the trilogy um, for the Planet of the, the latest incarnation of the Planet of the Apes. And so this one takes five, takes place five years after the second one, which is Dawn of the Planet of the Apes, in which uh, um, uh, the war against the apes uh, is continuing. However, there's a little bit of a twist uh, alongside uh, the human population uh, as the, the simian flu strain has mutated and then there's also some dissension in the ranks. This, uh, this story was really, was really good. Um, the pacing was a lot different from the second, uh, the second installment, and it was a slower pace, and and, uh, and it was just really well, well thought out, well, well done. Um, this time around, the the development for Woody Harrelson's character uh, was very, was very good. He was a great antagonist to Caesar, unlike. In the previous movie, I thought that they misused or underutilized Gary Oldman and his talents. Um, it was really the cinematography was excellent, and it was really had this western style, western feel to it, and with big vistas and um, you know just really long shots of the of the environment just really nice um, so the cinematography was excellent of course you know I don't want to harp on the, the visual effects and the makeup and it's just outstanding it's just outstanding I'm just gonna leave that alone because that's been consistent through all three movies on how they've developed these apes and what they look like and their interaction with the human world and stuff like that was just um, was just great so uh, I don't know, and I and I like the the touch of the the human girl in there. Um, I was worried at first, but she did not take away. And in fact, she was quite the device. Uh, so yeah, I don't know if there was really too much to really um, say was negative about this movie. It was just uh, really well done. A good, good ending chapter to the films, and uh, just another development for the character of Caesar, played by Andy Serkis. And yeah, it just was like, um, I mean, it was a little slower than the rest of them. Well, I mean, slower than Dawn of the Planet of the Apes, but I really don't think that that really took away from the film. Um, you know, you saw a couple of your your favorites uh, if you if you've been paying attention to the, the film, like Maurice and and Rocket, and you know, uh, but uh, but yeah, I mean, they they uh, there wasn't as much a battle, but uh, with the apes as as I thought there would be, um, but I'm not sure that that was also a negative what to what to really watch for is just um, like I said the cinematography uh, just outstanding outstanding job so what did you think about this film was it a good final chapter in, in this trilogy um, how do you how do you feel about Cesar being uh, you know one of those movie icons so like to hear more subscribe to the channel subscribe to the youtube channel uh, like us on facebook follow us on instagram all right see you next week